Yo, what's good? I am DJ Money Homie. And I am Girl Nosy Rosie. And welcome back to the check in. Former Texas police officer Aaron Dean has been charged with the murder of Tatiana Jefferson. If y'all do recall the story that happened early Saturday morning, uh, Officer Dean was responding to a call that a house was left with the doors open for a long period of time and the neighbor was real suspicious. When the officer got to the house, he knocked on the doors and knocked on the windows. When he went over to the side, he noticed a Tatiana Jefferson and he said, hands me air. And before he could even finish saying that, he fired a shot, instantly, oh. instantly killing a Tatiana Jefferson at her house. Wow. Not to mention that Tatiana Jefferson was actually playing video games while she was babysitting her nephew. Her Are you nephew. serious? Now, new evidence has resurfaced, and it shows that a Tatiana Jefferson did have a firearm in her hand, but that doesn't mm. mean anything because if you recall, Texas is just like Mississippi. You're okay. allowed to have a firearm in your home. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. Okay. But you, if you look at the actual footage, there was not enough time to make that out. Right, he, right. He shot first without even thinking about it. Mm. And if you're thinking from a Tatiana's standpoint, Come on, she's thinking somebody is late at right, night. Right, it's an and intruder, yeah, hands up. She doesn't, she doesn't know what's going on. So, right. of course, the first thing to do, because it is all right to bear arms, mm -hmm. she grabs her firearm. So, let me ask you this. What was the reason for them to even come to the house? Like, the neighbor said that the door, you know, um, you know how people have, they have their regular doors and they have the screen doors. Right, okay. And just like myself, I would leave the screen door locked and leave the door open. Yes, yes. But the video games, she was playing a video game. Right, and so did, did they make the... Uh, no, nah, it wasn't... That had, they had nothing, nothing to do with it anything. Had to do oh, wow. So it was just an attack for no reason. Do you think it was a racial attack? I, no, I think it was a bad cop attack. Yeah, okay. I think it was just a cop that does not know. He was overexcited, didn't know what was going on, mm. and he just took the shot in bad judgment. Wow, wow. So now he is facing charges. Yeah, but not to mention, everyone's in the uproar right now because he was released on a $200,000 bail. Wow. He only, paid two, he only paid 10% of that. So he ended up really only paying maybe two. $20, now, if you guys did not catch power this Sunday, then you guys know that we experienced a tragedy, honey. One of our favorite characters and our most hated characters, Miss Lakeisha, Tommy's baby mama slash girlfriend. She's not really his baby mama, but you know, he he might as well be. You know what I'm saying? That they they like this here. She got killed by Sasha. And not to mention, this is right after Tommy bought that brand new house in the suburbs. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. You guys, this episode was so heartfelt for everybody because honestly, nobody expected it. Honestly, Lakeisha, she was dealing with a lot in this episode. Now, Tommy's mom did disclose that information that he killed his ex-girlfriend, Holly. Now, if you guys don't know who Holly is, then check back a couple seasons from now. You're gonna see the red-headed girl that Tommy fell head over heels for. Mm -hmm. So, by Lakeisha, being uh targeted now in this episode i don't feel like tasha came to the home to kill keisha it was more so to just talk to her and to stain because keisha was gonna yeah. bounce she like i'm not telling nobody i'm like i'm not snitching yeah. on nobody and then things just got things just got out of hand and they escalated they and mm -hmm. she ended up getting killed which i was really sad about that too Honestly, and not to mention cash about to walk in the house with the fly with the fly oh I'm real hot. smooth, y'all. I'm pissed off about it. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm so mad about that. But you know what? I feel like this means war for Tommy. This is the only person because that Tommy really like. Of course, Tommy is about because of course Tommy is about to think the first person that comes to his mind is Ghost. But I mean, I definitely think that it's gonna be super, super lit for this Sunday. So if you guys have not catched Power, go watch Power, okay? Mm -hmm. This is free promotion from the check-in Power. We love y'all, keep doing what y'all doing, boo. All right, y'all, you know what time it is. It's time for our Artist of the Week, and the artist we choose this week is? My boy, King Ziki. Make sure y'all follow him on Instagram at King underscore Ziki. Here's his new song, I ain't with the talk of this shit the fuck up. I pull up a stick trying to shoot some shit up. We shot at y'all niggas ain't shoot at us. I gave her a print, now the bitch booted up. What's my wood? Bitch, this gay. All right, you guys, that is our show for this week. Make sure you follow us on all social media platforms. Follow the station at 977 FM. And don't forget, we do the show every Friday. I am DJ Money Home. And I am Girl Nosy Rosie. And this year is the check-in. <laughs>